Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Civilization V of Vox Populi. So we're playing in Sweden, and uh, Russia is becoming a bit of a runaway AI as we start this next episode. Uh, we are wearing down the mines, so hopefully we will be able to... Oh, we lost two units. That wasn't good. Well, we still have a lot more units, and uh, we are making good progress against TCAL, but we do have to uh, clear out the rest of these guys over here. Okay. Luckily, we have a lot of cannons nearby. And uh, let's see. These guys are going to go back onto auto build. And let's see what we can do with these guys over here. Let's start with that fusilier over there. In fact, let's actually start over here and uh, wear down TCAL a little bit. Maybe we should uh, hit the units first. Start with Nanjing over here, which just finished up his factory. Bring that fuselier forward. No, nope, it's too far back. Uh, okay, well, let's try. How about that guy? Now, do we hit the city or do we. Well, actually, this guy can't hit the city, so. Well, let's work on that fuselier over there. Okay, can that guy move out of the way? Okay, let's move you back there. Although we're going to need something to uh, block the way so that our cannons are safe. So let's move you hmm, right in range of that Chukano. And it's a little bit out of our range for our cannon. Okay, how about this guy? You're also going to hit the city because everything else is a little bit too far away. This guy could help out with the units. So yeah, that's probably a good idea at this point. Shots with the cannon there. I mean, with the uh, right, with the uh, what are those guys? Musketmen. Okay, factory is now done. We should probably work on a few um, reinforcements because we're getting a little bit weak. Just lost two fusiliers this turn, so this guy's gonna have to go around the long way. Okay, let's bring that guy back. So this unit can... Let's move you over there for now. So we can move around a little bit more. Yeah, too many for us. It, uh, they're good for defense, but it does make it harder to move around. Maybe we can uh, go around and come in from Tikal from the north. Let's do that. Okay, you can go to Nanjing. You can come up onto the hill here. And 
let's move that great general into Nanjing. That should help to reinforce things. And you can wait there. Fortunately, we don't have enough money to upgrade these guys. Yeah, I think our uh, infantry is going to have to come around from the north through Tikal. So let's move you up there too. And you know what, in Beijing, let's queue up another... Um, do you want a Caroline or do you want a Fusilier? I think it might actually be better to go with a Caroline next because um, we can produce them faster and they have those nice promotions. So let's do that with Nanjing too. Said the Fusilier just so we can get them that much faster. Okay, and that unit is going to come over here. And let's see, the musketmen. You know what, I think we're all going to try to come in from the north there, although this guy cannot move too much further. Well, we can move him a single square. So let's do that. Now these guys... All right. Let's take out that fuselier there. Then we can ha take one more shot on the city. And the Great General will stay there. And we can even take a couple of shots with this musketman. Okay, that guy is going to move down there. And let's move you right next to Tikal. And that guy is going to fortify where he is. And so is that guy. And yeah, let's take another look at where all the troops are. Probably should have done that first. So it doesn't look so bad, but we're going to have to make sure we wrap this up quickly. And yeah, Zeppelin can stay. And actually we should have a finished up market uh, up in Guangzhou. Oh, we've already queued up a monument, so hopefully that situation is going to improve up there. Okay, next. Still at minus nine happiness, not so happy about that, but we should have another golden age coming in soon. Okay, oh. And yeah, we're losing a lot in that area there. Just because there's so, so many ranged units over here. Okay, time for an event choice. The Minister of Agriculture is doing his thing again. Oh, we stole some gold at least. That's good. Okay, we can fire upon an enemy here, but let's get some vision back first. Move that guy onto the mountaintop. Okay, more shots on Tikal. I think uh, three or four more turns we should be okay as long as we can keep this up. You know, we may not actually need a unit over there. If uh, someone comes up, if they come close with their ranged units, I think we'll be okay. We'll hold back for now. It's a lot more defensible that way. Famous last words, I know. Fortunately, we have a whole lot of squishy cannons on the front row here, but uh, I think we can manage for now. Oh, well, not with that guy. He's too far away. So let's hit that Gatling gun instead. And we will take a shot on the Fusilier back there. And that unit will also hit the Gatling gun. And we will take, we'll use our musketmen down here too. Though, would the Gatling gun be a better choice? Uh, let's keep going for the uh, Fusilier. And you can... Oh, you're, you're already done this turn? 
Well, let's back up. That guy will stay in place. That all looks good for now. Uh, let's move you a little bit closer this way. So we can replace that guy if we have to. In fact, maybe that guy should move back onto the marble. Although, would that make him easier to hit? Let's see. Uh, we already got the vision, so... Hmm. No, let's leave him where he is. We can heal up a little bit. Uh, Montgomery will stay there in Nanjing. Uh, as will that unit. Okay, oh, this guy is getting a lot of uh, damage. So let's hit that Gatling gun again. Curiouser will stay where he is. Uh, fortify here, fortify with Caroline, and a couple more shots on Tikal. All right. Let's move these guys around. Oh, we have a new archaeologist. Uh, we have a uh, dig outside Nanjing, and we have one down by Beijing. You know what? Let's skip the one. Well, no. I was thinking of going for Nanjing, but you know, let's stay away from the war war area for now. Let's do that one next. Put you up there. That Caroline is going to come over this way. And let's see, Musketman is also going to go around that way. And Caravan. Where should we ship this to? From Turku to. Who has highest gold? We could use some gold. Uh, well, I guess we can trade with Ethiopia. Not a bad idea right now. 18 gold, 8 science. I think we will be able to do something with that. And let's see. Um, yep. Let's get a little bit of vision back. In fact, maybe better to come down here so we could go on top of that mountain in the future. So into the fort for now. And okay. Next turn, or let's see, anything else to read here? Okay, yeah, robbery and stuff. Okay, next turn. Decal healed back up. Oh, and they're uh, advancing with the Fusiliers. Quite a few units there. We might have to pull back a bit. And we got the Eiffel Tower. Great. And uh, reduces boredom in all cities, and new policies cost 10% less. And we should get another policy in seven turns. So let's see. Um, okay. How do we get rid of these guys? Well, we can start off by poking that guy, and uh, we need another trade route down here in Malmo. Uh, let's send that to Lalibella for a little bit of food and science. And okay, our unhappiness is doing a little bit better. Choose production in. Whoops. Choose production. Okay, Eiffel Tower is now done. Uh, no, getting another caravan in our capital is probably a good idea. And we just finished the factory down here. Probably could use a fusilier like that one. Guangzhou, we just finished the monument, so let's see, what else we need here? Still huge unhappiness. Crime, illiteracy, poverty. Let's see, uh, barracks would be good, and let's keep up a few more things in Guangzhou. Uh, let's see, a forge, definitely helpful, and a library. Okay, 
We do need other stuff too, but I think that would be a good start. Yeah, the, uh, that should help with uh, defense and learning and uh, a bit of production boost there. So let's get those built. Westress is starving. Okay, so how do we do with these uh, fusiliers who just showed up? Well, that guy's gonna have to hit decal because there's no one else to hit. Uh, let's see. Okay, that guy is gonna have to back up. Probably down onto the railroad there. Actually, that might even be a... Uh, let's put you on the coal. You can fortify till he'll down there. This guy is going to... And these guys have plus one range yet. You're gonna come back there. And this guy is getting a lot of damage. So we'll pull you... Actually, maybe we better put you into the city. Where can you go to? No more useful on this turn. Cursors only have 25. That's against 35 on that unit. Hmm. Okay, let's swap these two. And then let's swap those two. And you can hit that unit. Then we can use the cannon to hit the fusilier again. Actually, then we can use... You still have a shot, although you're too far away to hit anything, so you're just gonna heal up in Nanjing. This guy will hit that unit. Then I think we can uh, take him out with a fusilier. And bring this guy up here. And uh, to help block the way. And you can go stand on that lumber mill over there. This guy will take a few more shots at that fusilier over there. We could almost get him with this unit. Not sure how much, how many other units are in the area. Let's take a look with our blimp. Yeah, there's that cannon back there still. So we could put this guy over here, although he would then... Actually, no, I don't think uh, the musketman and Oxmo could hit him, but the cannon could, and uh, so could that unit. Although, if he's at full health, I think he'll still be okay. Actually, Zurich could do something too. Yeah, because that guy's on the road, so he could uh, come up and hit over there too, so maybe not the safest thing to do with that guy just yet. Uh, let's see. And no, we can't go through the forest out to over there. Okay, let's just move that guy closer so we can uh, have more movement on the next turn. Uh, Montgomery can stay in Nanjing. You can heal up down there. Hernan Cortez can stay put. Okay, what are we going to do about uh, these units over here? I think it might actually be better to just keep working on Tikal and staying out of the way as best we can. 
So we'll let that guy uh, heal up this turn. And uh, meanwhile, this guy can continue to bombard Tikal. This might actually be a good opportunity for an upgrade. Although that's going to be 940 gold. That's about half of our gold. Hmm. Given his... Oh, there's a uh, ironclad coming. I have to be careful about that. I think this might be a good time to upgrade that guy. Okay, unit needs orders. Even though we are hurting for gold a little bit right now. Uh, Caroline. Well, yeah, unfortunately we can't come around through the back, so... These guys are just going to have to queue up over here and uh, wait for the situation to improve. Okay, let's get that guy up there. And this musketman, can he do anything useful? Probably not. It's too crowded over there, too far away. Let's move you closer just in case we need uh, something, in case they start sending ships around here means we'll get you out of the way and you can go up there and the rest of these guys are just gonna hang out for now and uh, you can stay there you can continue to fortify there and let's start that archaeological dig uh, yeah you are done for now too Okay, that all looks good. And I'm not worried about that missionary. I think uh, he's got bigger things to worry about. Okay, next turn. Hopefully we can take Tikal soon. That should uh, really turn the tide here. And let's see, a landmark from the medieval era? Well, we'll still take that. Yep. There beside Addis Ababa. And that's a nice tile now. Okay, oh, and more archaeology. Uh, let's see, uh, ancient era by the uh, Wangju over here. So let's see, landmark. Don't mind if I do. Oh, no, Beijing has that one. Okay, that's a nice culture boost. Okay, and... Uh, How's this look? I guess that's as good as we can hope for, for now. Actually, let's reinforce this area a little bit. No, we can't bring that guy in. Okay, he's almost out of movement points, so let's put you over there. Okay, next turn. Okay, we lost another uh, rifle fusilier. So uh, these troops over here are pretty tough. And Catherine just finished the Empire State Building. She is getting very strong. Okay, uh, well, let's enjoy the floods over there. Not entirely sure what we're going to do with Russia when the time comes. Okay, uh, what else? Uh, that was done in Moscow. Moscow is turning to a very nice city. Trade route plundered um, between Gao and Jerusalem. Okay, that's probably the Mayans doing that. Okay, uh, and they're sending some galleases at us. Well, we can uh, wear those guys down. Luckily, we have some uh, riflemen in the area. I mean, um, musketmen in the area. So we have some ranged power. Okay, Ethiopia took some gold from us. That's not nice. Okay, let's get some vision before we start this turn. Okay, that cannon might actually be takeable with our uh, Zeppelin. Maybe he'll move a little bit closer. In any case, back to Tikal. Well, the positive news is we have a lot of infantry over here. So we shouldn't have to worry too much about them breaking through and getting our cannons. Uh, 
Okay, Caravan is going to go to, well, actually, uh, we could trade with the city states. 16 and 8 up there versus 12, 4, and 8. So, would Melbourne be a better idea? A little bit less money, a lot more culture. I think we'll trade with Melbourne for now. And uh, we're going to need another trader out. Stockholm. And a lot of happiness here, but crime is still an issue. Well, we should. Oh, observatory. That would be useful. And then we can probably build a trade route somewhere else. Okay, promote a unit. Uh, okay, this guy is going to. Well, let's go for volley, so that'll be useful when we finally use him against the city, although. He's a little bit too far away from the city right now. Yep. But we can get rid of that fusilier. So let's do that. Okay, once more against Decal. I think we'll just hold tight with our units in the front here. And focus what we can on the city, although not with that guy. Which one of these guys has plus one range? That guy does. So let's move you over here, so you can do something more useful in the future. You can hit that fusilier. Hmm. This guy is not in good shape, although he can get uh, some cover, so that will help a bit. Unfortunately, he is, yeah, I would like to swap him with somebody, but uh, who? Well, I guess these guys down here. Can't really move him back anywhere, though. Okay, let's move you up there. You can go into the forest there. You can go up there. This guy can heal. Let's have you scout a little bit. Yep. And go back to our territory. Okay, Montgomery can stay in Nanjing. You can heal. That guy will stay where he is. Now we can actually come forward and take out that unit. Should we? We will heal a little bit if we take it, but then we know that there's a whole lot of artillery around here, so. I think holding the line is a smarter thing to do. Uh, you will pillage that and fortify. You will also fortify. And Catling Gun is now got his super enhanced strength. So let's uh, wear down T Cal a bit. Meanwhile, this guy. Should probably come up and uh, take over here in Guangzhou because this guy has some ranged ability. Although I think that Gallius is too far away for now. Oh, and there's still one unit behind the city. Let's not forget about that. Uh, let's see. And um, actually, maybe we should swap with uh, these guys beside Decal because these units have a little bit more strength. Okay, and let's fortify with those guys. 
and let's move you a little closer and fortify okay you are done for this turn okay that all looks good okay and I think I will cut it there come back next time uh, we are making a lot of progress on TCAL will we get it find out uh, thanks for watching